Wasn't sure you'd come back. But I guess you're full of surprises. This squealer here ran security up at the chalet. Lucky for us, he wasn't that good at his job and wound up in my kiddie pool. Seems the place is being used as a training ground for the Chosen. If you've seen them in action, you know how ruthless they are. You know what Jacob taught him to use for target practice? Live bodies. Gets their first kill jitters out of the way. These motherfuckers don't value any life that ain't in their cult. And they need to be put down like the dogs they are. So you're gonna head up to that chalet. You're gonna kill every chosen you see, and you're gonna rig that building with explosives. And then we're gonna watch that whole fucking place turn into a smoldering heap of ash. Sound good to you?
ain't that a pretty sight? Good fucking riddance. You gotta understand something, Deb. No one comes back from Jacob's chair the same. I've seen it. First hand. You go in one way, and you come out another. Eli thinks you're clear, but only time will tell. We're down there now! Anyhow, plenty more to do back at the Wolf's Den. Stop by if you're around, and thanks, Deb, for all you've been doing.
be out of here soon enough. Did you think you were free? Well, your little buddy went to a whole lot of trouble for nothing. That's okay. He knows better now. I told you, you're not a hero. You are a tool. You know your purpose. You've known it from the beginning. You're a warrior.
make this world seem right. Only you can make the darkness right. Only you. <laughs> hey, only you can have this close. Only you could have earned his trust. It was always only ever you. Good work. You did it. You passed your test. You made your sacrifice. But now, you're alone. And you're weak. And we know what happens to the weak. I call her. It's what I do. I'll be outside waiting for you. what he does and we let him right in you find that motherfucker you find Jacob and you kill him or next time I see you so help me God I'll kill you myself running errands for a teenager and a housewife? The Whitetails are nothing without Eli. You are nothing without Eli. You're tougher than I thought. But killing me won't change a goddamn thing. You think I give a shit if I die? That's my purpose. I give my life for Joseph's, and I do it gladly. I understand my role. I am his sacrifice. Simple as that. Don't fight it. Just let go. You've served your purpose. find it ironic that everyone you try to help winds up with us? <gasps> Eli. Pratt. Tragedy just follows you. If you really wanted to keep people safe, be a hero. You just off yourself. Safer for everyone that way.
it's time.